Hawaii mourns the loss of a native son who spent his career building, nurturing, and nurturing relationships among Pacific Island nations and providing help to native Hawaiian children. Bob Worthington was the financial aid director for Kamehameha Schools for many years. He built its assistance for Native Hawaiian children to administering more than 15,000 awards worth a total of $25 million annually. The U.S. State Department named Worthington the honorary counsel to the Cook Islands, a post he served for nearly 20 years. Worthington worked tirelessly for the Polynesian Voyaging Society as well. After Hokulea's historic voyages to Tahiti in 1976 and 1976, in 1980, Worthington helped rekindle and build relationships with other Polynesian nations, paving the way for the voyage of rediscovery in 1985. He is survived by his wife, five children, and five grandchildren. He was 72 years old. Services will be at Kamehameha Schools tomorrow at 11 with viewing from 9. His ashes will be scattered off the Outrigger Canoe Club at 8 a.m. on Monday. And it's a great loss. He was a wonderful, wonderful man. Well, he served on the executive board of the Polynesian Voyaging Society, was an ambassador to the South Pacific, and worked at Kamehameha Schools for 29 years. Bob Worthington passed away last week at the age of 72. Amy Kalili takes a look back at his accomplishments. Aloha mai kako. He mea nui e paio ana no ka pono mau o ka mauli ola Hawaii. He elele kalai aina hia pai ole o na po ai paki pika hema. A he kako o lua ole ma hope o ka imi na awa o uivi Hawaii. E yu noho i ko aha i olelo ola ke ho o mana o aku nei mi ke aloha pau ma ko nui. Ya Bob Wellington. Bob Worthington. 29 year career that he had here at Kamehameha and he did a lot of different things including director of boarding. He oversaw our student exchange program and then he of course was the director of our financial aid and that, in my mind this is where he made the greatest impact for Kamehameha and for the Hawaiian community. <laughs> I remember you know he and Jean were always so welcoming. I remember lying in bed uh, at Hale Pelikikena and I could hear the drums and I could hear the singing, I could hear the laughter because he lived down the street. It was just fun, you know. I, I just, I remember that with a great deal of fondness. His humility, his compassion, his patience, his kindness, his humor. Bob was a good friend and a real honorable man. Bob's rolling at least in the Polynesian Boarding Society and, and the Ohana Va of, of the Pacific. I mean, on the surface, he was a board member, you know, providing governance and guidance. He was navigating and leading and orchestrating and laying foundations from behind, constantly from behind. There are great individuals that drove their lives by their values and did what they believed in, and in, in such powerful ways we can measure that their lives count, and that is Robert Worthington. Coming up tomorrow, a memorial will be held for Bob Worthington at Kamehameha Schools Chapel from 9 to 11 a.m. with service to follow. Obviously a man who's definitely going to be missed. Absolutely.